Hi. What are you doing out here? Uh, yeah. You kind of scared me. I thought someone had kidnapped you. Not to mention that I don't even know how you were able to get out of my sight. Exactly. Apparently, you're more sneaky than I give you credit for. Mm. Mm. So, what's bothering you? I can see it clearly on your face. Not to mention that you never chill on the roof. Ever. No, you're not getting out of this. We are talking about it over a cup of hot cocoa. There, much better than that gold, wouldn't you say? Now, here's your cup. I made it myself, though, in case it's bad, I had Martha make one. Well, I rushed when I was making <laughs> our cups, as I am supposed to be around you at all times to, you know, not keep you from getting killed. Yep, made it in your favorite mug. I still can't believe you made that thing. Of course not! What woman would believe their lover when they take a photo of them randomly and say, I'm going to use it for a mug? Yes, the mug is really well done because you custom ordered it. But that doesn't change my feelings on it. A mug with you on it. I do have to admit that is an enticing offer. I'll think about it. Now, let's stop getting sidetracked. I still want to know what's gotten you in the dumps. Yeah, I can tell. You're already much happier. All you need was your love. <laughs> Something I could have told you from the beginning. I am not cocky. I just know that you need. But that is my job as your bodyguard and girlfriend. <laughs> it's nothing unusual. Whoa, whoa, there is no way I heard that right. You did not just say that. I am not going to quit my job. Why would you ever think that? You're scared for me? <sighs> when we first got together three months ago, I could already tell that you were starting to get overly worried about my jobs and the length that I'd have to go to save your life when it needed. But I didn't stay to anything because I thought you'd get over it. No, I totally understand. We're closer than ever before now. Neither of us would have known what to do if the other was gone. Think about this. Basically, everyone who's in a relationship would like to have nothing more than the ability to protect their loved one themselves. But not everyone is cut out to be a professional bodyguard, or anything similarly powerful. I'm glad that I am capable of protecting you, with my skill and equipment. So, no matter what you're gonna say, I am not quitting. Yup. You are always going to have a girlfriend and a bodyguard in one. <laughs> Should I slap the great value sticker on my forehead now? <laughs> well, actually, you're not always going to have a girlfriend. In the future, you're going to have a wife. That got your attention, huh? Yeah. I'm gonna put a ring on that finger. Just you wait. That blush of yours never ceases to be cute. Mwah. So please, don't worry about me, my love. I understand that you're going to be worried for me, but there is no need to drive yourself crazy with thoughts of what might happen. Since we've gotten together, my worry for you has also tripled. But I don't let it get to me. 
I just use it as drive to give you cuddles, the extra tight ones every night. Speaking of cuddles, it's late and you're clearly tired. Let's go home and cuddle. Yes, I am a cuddleholic. A cuddleholic for you. What? I can tell that you're too tired for the trip home. So, carrying you to and from the car is the best option. <laughs> oh, I could already tell you like it, which is very good. Because I'll carry you like this on our wedding day. <laughs> now, let's get you home, your blushing majesty. Hi, uh, thank you so much for watching, and please like and subscribe for future videos.